To access free topic sheets, worksheets, or to book an online class, visit ilearneasy.co.uk. Layers of the Atmosphere In this video, we will learn about the different layers of the atmosphere. The Earth's atmosphere has five main layers and several secondary layers. The five main layers include the troposphere, stratosphere, mesosphere, thermosphere and exosphere. Troposphere The troposphere is the lowest atmospheric layer. It extends from the Earth's surface to about 10 to 12 miles in height. This layer contains several things, including all the air that plants need for photosynthesis and that animals need to breathe. The troposphere also contains about 99% of all water vapour and aerosols. Most of the Earth's weather happens in this layer. Almost all clouds that are generated by weather are found in the troposphere. The temperature of this layer decreases the higher you go. This is because most of the heat found in the troposphere is generated by the transfer of energy from the Earth's surface. The troposphere is also the densest atmospheric layer. This is because it's compressed by the weight of the rest of the atmosphere above it. So, to summarise, the troposphere is the lowest layer, most of the Earth's weather happens in this layer, the temperature decreases with increase in altitude, and it's the densest layer. Stratosphere the stratosphere is the second lowest layer in the Earth's atmosphere. It's approximately 30 to 35 miles above the Earth's surface. This layer contains the Earth's ozone layer. The ozone layer is the layer in the atmosphere that helps to absorb the sun's harmful ultraviolet radiation. This UV radiation is the reason why the temperature in the stratosphere becomes warmer the higher up you go. The stratosphere is the highest part of the atmosphere that aeroplanes can fly around in. And unlike the troposphere, the stratosphere is nearly cloud and weather free. So to summarise, the stratosphere is the second layer. It contains the Earth's ozone layer and it's cloud and weather free. Mesosphere The mesosphere is located about 50 miles above the Earth's surface. This layer gets progressively colder with altitude, so the higher up we go in this layer, the colder it will become. The top of the mesosphere layer has an average temperature of about minus 85 degrees Celsius. This is the coldest place found within the Earth's system. Most meteors will burn upon entry into the mesosphere. So to summarise, the mesosphere is the third layer in the atmosphere. And it's a very cold layer. Thermosphere The thermosphere is located about 400 miles above the Earth's surface. The air in this layer is very thin and the temperature can become very hot. The temperature increases with altitude, so the temperature rises the higher we go. This is due to the very low density of molecules found in this layer. This layer is both cloud and water vapour free. The thermosphere's lowest layer contains the ionosphere. This is the layer in which most atoms are ionised and where electrical charge is found. The thermosphere is also where the aurora occurs. This is commonly known as the southern and northern lights. So to summarise, the thermosphere is the fourth layer. 
The air in this layer is very thin and this layer can become quite hot. It's cloud and water vapour free, it contains the ionosphere and it's where the aurora occurs. Exosphere The exosphere is located about 6,200 miles above Earth's surface. It's the highest layer of the Earth's atmosphere. The air is very thin in this layer and there is also no weather at all. The molecules found in the exosphere are of extremely low density. Therefore, this layer doesn't behave like a gas and the particles in this layer escape into space. Most Earth satellites orbit in the exosphere. So to summarise, the troposphere is the lowest layer, the temperature decreases with increase in altitude and it's the densest layer. The stratosphere is the second layer. It contains the Earth's ozone layer and it's cloud and weather free. The mesosphere is the third layer and it can become very cold. The thermosphere is the fourth layer. The air in this layer is very thin and it can become very hot. It is cloud and water vapour free. It contains the ionosphere and it's where the aurora occurs. The exosphere is the fifth layer. It contains very thin air and there is no weather in this layer.